sum up what that means and, and how you felt? Uh, thank you. It obviously feels good. It's it's been a good campaign till now. Uh, to win your first five games, you obviously put yourself in a very strong position. Uh, I, I said that the 15 points is what was going to qualify, not the fact that Spain beat Norway. Uh, obviously, that finalised the the qualification. So, really proud of my players. Delighted for the players. Uh, they put a lot of work in over the last just over four years in my my reign as head coach, and it's it's fantastic for them to be at the the second major finals after such a long barren spell for Scottish football. This team. It shows that they, they understand that they have to work hard. Obviously, the last time we qualified for the Euros, it was through the the playoff system. It felt a little bit like sneaking in the back door. This time we can walk straight in the front door with our heads held high uh, and look forward, hopefully, to a, a good tournament next summer. But before that, we have to finish the group properly. We've got two competitive games next next month and we we want to finish on a high. Believing every time that you can qualify. Well, that's the position we want to be. We want to, I said when I took the job, we want to, or I said when we qualified for the last the last tournament, that we want to be at major tournaments more often. We Unfortunately, we missed out in the World Cup by losing in the playoffs, which was which was sore. But I think in this campaign, we've shown that we, we've learned some lessons from that. Don't, well, don't leave it to chance. Don't leave it to a one-off game. Try and get yourselves out of the group, and we've managed to do that. Would we'll tell us about the, the celebrations. Thanks very much. Uh, yeah, last night we just watched the uh, Spain and Norway game in camp. Everyone together, coaching staff and players, and obviously uh, enjoyed the result and the end of it and uh, had a glass of champagne to celebrate. And uh, yeah, the, the boys, it's always special to celebrate it with that, that group. We've got a unique bond and uh, it's, it's a great achievement for the country. So. Uh, very proud to manage to achieve that with two games remaining. Do you feel this time around the tournament one country and especially in a country like Germany? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, the last one, unfortunately, was marked a wee bit with COVID. So uh, I think the biggest thing the players are thinking about is, is the fans that will travel out there in the tens of thousands and um, how special it is to, to have their backing. Uh, even on a Thursday night, for example, in Seville, uh, they travelled in their thousands and that's greatly appreciated from every single person in that squad and it'll be actually uh, special to experience that in Germany with themselves and, and hopefully we can make them uh, extremely proud. I mean, that sends out to the rest of the European teams. Yeah, as, as I said, well, we're in a really good place at the minute uh, to qualify in that manner of which we have done is uh, impressive from our point of view, but we don't want to just stop there. We want to keep, keep continuing to build on what we've created so far, and I think we can do that. These last few games that we've had against top opposition, I think will help us do that, and we'll learn from it and take these experiences into the games in the summer. Uh, and I'm sure that will put us in really good stead, and hopefully we can have a really positive impact on that tournament.